Animals have many healing powers, especially those who are trained to provide affection and comfort. A therapy dog named Murphy is providing just that to a population needing it most, children in hospitals. Our CBS 58's Yukari Nakayama tells us the impact Murphy the therapy dog is making at Children's Wisconsin. This four-legged fluffy golden doodle named Murphy is among one of the most popular visitors at Children's Wisconsin. Anywhere he goes, some head pats and scratches follows. But Murphy is here at Children's Wisconsin on the clock. Murphy is one, a one of about 18 therapy dog teams. We're, we're a team here at Children's Hospital. Every Wednesday for two hours, Murphy and his owner, Lori Olner, visit children who are at the hospital for an extended period of time, like Bella, a 13-year-old who is awaiting a heart transplant, <laughs> in hopes of lifting their spirits up and comfort them throughout their stay. A little one will be having a bad day, crying, you know, and we walk in and instant happiness, instant change in the kiddo's personality. It's just a really nice memory for us to know that we made their day better. There you go. Good job. Murphy and his owner Lori have been a therapy team for two years, Lori having close ties to Children's Wisconsin. <laughs> well, I was a nurse here for 34 years. I retired two years ago and we pretty much started up therapy dog visits um, shortly after that. So she knows the difference it makes in a child's day when a therapy dog pays a visit. Dogs just instantly make people feel calmer and they can sense, he can sense when a child is upset. You know, he'll get real close to them and real, real quiet and he'll just try to make them feel calmer. Lori says the dogs don't only help the patients, but also the parents and even the staff. Their presence creating a domino effect of positivity. Just to have a dog come in for five, 10 minutes, it's just a good, something new in their, you know, in their day, um, away from the test and the worry and the stress. Murphy and Lori also visit a nursing home and the Ronald McDonald House throughout the week. Seeing the influence of their work, Lori is now a big advocate for others to become a therapy team. Dogs just want to be loved. They love to be around people. And if you have a dog that is really good with people, loves to be petted, you know, consider being a therapy team because you can really make a big impact. She says the most rewarding part, seeing the smile brought to a child's face. I just, I love doing this. It's the best part of my week. Sailing